things that we wanted for him at home were not to pull, because he pulled me down the stairs a couple times. Um, not like falling, but like, oh crap, here we go. Um, sit. He doesn't pull down the stairs anymore. He walks right next to me, going, sit. Um, outside, he listens to Joe better now. He doesn't fuss with brother anymore. Sit. <laughs> Do you use treats ever with them? Um, we have a little bit been. They, for him, almost seem to be a distraction. Okay. And then he looks for to work on that. Good job. Over to you if you want to try. So you kind of see I'm not using a lot of words. Good job. You saw, I'm sure you saw last time with like trying to pet his ears and things like he was just like I can't handle it now he's like he'll let me pet his ears and he's okay with this like he likes yeah. this now as for, compared to last time when we were here and he was like it was sensory overload for you to just pet his, like just being pet on the head was so much for him that he couldn't even handle it it's the same with treats now he's like oh, same with treats now he's like Oh, I could have a treat, and it's okay. <laughs> brought you down to earth, Kelly. <laughs> we like it. It's We're just way up here. <laughs> it's just so much. Like it's one of those things where you see other people's dogs that are collar trained, and you're like, wouldn't it be nice if my dog's like that? But you just, it's so hard to see through the blockhead. Yeah. And now he's so much better, and, and that's just a like, fun lesson. Yeah. yeah.